scooter. You want your scooter? Uh -huh. Okay, hold on. I'll go Hello. get it. Hello. <laughs> Let me go grab the scooter. All right, I got the scooter. No, it's okay. She didn't mean to. Slide down the road. Tell everybody where you went today. On a field trip to Cane Creek. And I found some giant fossils. I found like 200 pounds worth of fossils. You found it's a lot of fossils. Time. Yeah, and they were really cool. They were like three foot into the, into the thing. So it was really hard to dig them up, but I got them up eventually. And he came home filthy. He had to go take a shower right away. Yeah. He had to clean his shoes up. Look how nice they look. Put on some play clothes. They they're, they're clean, way cleaner now. They, they, they were brown. They brand new now. Let's see how clean your hands are. Oh, they're still kind of. Yeah, it was hard to get it off. Like, I was washing my hands multiple times. I couldn't get it off. Do you remember the other day that Samuel got those from a different store? I do remember when he got those shoes. Stop. If you want some, I got them from the mall at Journey Kids. Journey Kids, is that where we got them from? Yeah, Journey Kids. That's where my friend got some. They're his, they're his pair, too. He has the same Well, pair do you want to show everybody your fossils? Or whatever they're called? Um, yeah. Okay, go you go downstairs and then uh, open the garage door, and I'll walk around down there, and we show them. Because they're in the garage. All right. So, we're going down here to meet Daniel <laughs> to meet his fossils. To meet his fossils, to see his fossils. Hey, watch out for dog poop. That one right there poops right here. Did I step in some the other day? Remember that? Uh -huh. I stepped in dog poop and thought it was mud. Uh -huh. And I walked all through the house uh -huh. and got it all through the house. And I was like, it's no big deal because I'll just go back and sweep it up in a few minutes. <laughs> and then I was like, wait a minute, what's that smell? And it was dog poop. Yay. I stepped in dog. Come on, let's go. Me. I stepped in dog poop. Tracked it all through the house. Had to wash. I knew it was disgusting. Had to wash my shoes. It was terrible. Do you remember the other day that Samuel killed a mouse right there? Samuel, ki Samuel killed a mouse? I think he found a dead mouse. I think something else killed it, like our cat. And Samuel just found it. Right here. You gonna show him? Yes. I'm gonna just put the lights. <coughs> you gonna flip on the lights? I'm not sure how much that helps, but we can see it. I got big pieces. Oh. So these are rock. Mama, wheels. this is what I found. Uh -huh. And rock That's wheels where us. is where like ancient ancient crabs, like they these were like a couple thousand years old when dinosaurs were around. Crabs they would eat the inside of the clam, but they would just dig around the the shell and stuff. And then just throw the shell back in the water, and eventually it would all build up and create something. This is my small one because my big one I can hardly even pick it up. But this is my small one. That's the small one. Look at all of the little minerals in it. It's got all these white lines. Hold on, just a minute. Let me holler at Scott. Scott, get back over here where we can see you. It's got all these little minerals. That looks like maybe. A muscle or something, but I've also got something that I like. Oh no, my shoe! No, no, your shoe come off. Probably the most. It is really neat. It is. You probably never heard of this, but I just learned of it today. It's called the state fossil. The state fossil. We got a state fossil. I can't remember what it's called, but this we found it. Did you found part of the state fossil, didn't you? I found part of the state fossil. Oh, here's a real clean part of a muscle that's a couple thousand years old but i think this yes that is part of the state fossil i'm not sure what animal it is to but i think this is the mouth of it the like, mouth. it's got teeth yeah Ew. and this okay, is really cool what i found i think it's some kind of jawbone but i'm not quite sure let me see if we can focus it Kind of like a hook. <laughs> I've also Love got Daniel. this really cool one. This one took me a real long time to get out of the sand. I almost broke it, but I put like a layer, this weird stuff on it. Can't remember what it's called, but I put a layer of it. It fixed it. That's a thick clam. Clam. That shows you how old it is. All that stuff is built up on it, made it that thick. That's interesting. And just a little piece of a clam. I thought I had a piece of. The ancient snail. Ancient snails. Oh, <laughs> um, my friend. He found one that big. <gasps> Did he? 
Who was that? Agent Snell. Um, first names only. First name, I think it was Alex. Alex. It was, it was cool. And, he, and he also, Alex also found a complete, um, a complete, what is it called? A complete, um, muscle from like 4,000 years ago, too. Wow. Fully complete. Pretty cool, pretty cool. He had a fun field day. Look at that spider. There's a spider? That's better, dead spider. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> dead spider she found. All right, and we'll shut this here garage door. Let me find the button and step out. There we go. Ooh, that's good. That's good. It's closing. Closing time. Yeah, we'll try to ollie over this real quick. Huh? We'll try to ollie over this. Okay. Is that where you do that jumping? Oh. oh we almost did it. Mama, Is she going to get your here, shoes dirty here. again? Yeah. Here. What? So, this is what I found. <laughs> She's going to tell us what she found. Whoa, you found an ancient but, dinosaur. No. This you didn't? <laughs> oh, oh, what is it? That's for us. We found them in a bath bomb. Oh, okay. In a bath bomb. And Shallow chewed the towel up and you know it broke. <laughs> yeah, you find it. Shallow, shallow chewed the towel up. Found it in the garbage can. <laughs> What's the other thing you got? This one. This is mine. It came out. It looks like a bead. Yeah. Well, it's a bracelet had um bows. It had bows on it. Oh, Where's the cat? I heard him meow, and there he is. Okay, cat's safe and sound. Yep. <sighs> this is what we get for your daddy <laughs> dumping the <laughs> little <laughs> shot back out right here. I don't know if that. That's nasty. <laughs> Why do you man do the things you do? You see, the husband dumped the shot back out in the driveway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused by this situation. The popcorn journal. Could have very easily dumped that in the garbage can. Yeah. But what do I know? Or out in those woods. Nasty you found something else? You better yeah. quit digging in that. You're going to get all nasty. I bet if you dig it up in the microwave, you can make a popcorn. Ooh, a popcorn kernel. I bet if you dig it up in the microwave, you can make a popcorn. Oh, well, yeah. I'm not about to do that. <laughs> uh, we put that down. That's a. That's what um they put on, like, ear things. Ear earbuds. Earplugs? Earbuds. Oh. Found, like the tip of an earbud. Yeah, of course. Got earwax all over it. You're the stopper. Yeah, that's stop. That red means stop? Yeah. Is stop. it are you the stop sign? Stop. Oh, okay. My bad. When can I go? Go over there. I have to go that way. So are you like in control of the road? Okay. Go. I'm going. Okay, before the car there's so many cars coming. Come here, kitty. Oh, it feels so good out here. I'm so going to hate it when it gets really cold. <laughs> There's our marshmallow, not marshmallow pit. What am I saying? Our fire pit where we made marshmallows. Good boy. Stop. I stopped. Huh. You found a piece of petrified wood. Hey, there's a petrified forest somewhere down in mid. Where are you going? Somewhere down in like, I think Jackson, Mississippi. Hey, run up there with her. Please. Anyway, there's a petrified forest somewhere, I think, down in Jackson. Past Jackson. <coughs> Got it. <coughs> okay, I don't remember. I was choking to death. Hey, you two don't fight around me. Go on, Shallow. Um, hold on. Somewhere in South Mississippi. I don't know if it's around Jackson, Mississippi or not. But there's a... Oh, I'm... Oh, the sinuses. The allergies. Oh. Anyway, there's a, a petrified forest. We've never been, but I know that it's there. That's where I'm going with this. I can't remember what it's called. If you live in Mississippi and you've never been, or if you want to go to Mississippi and visit, there's something you can go check out. <laughs> That's not okay, I'm gonna fill up this water bowl. So Scarlet fell apparently on the rocks and cut her hand. Um, it's nothing major, you know. Skint it, cut it with a rock. It was bleeding a little bit. Um, 
But my daughter is so dramatic, y'all. Sid just coming over telling us that she hurt herself. She ran all the way to the house, around the house. And we're like, where are you going? And then I sit Samuel after her, and then I heard crying, and I heard him hollering, what are you doing? What are you doing? And she was running away, running all the way, like, towards the road. And, of course, I had to go after her. And I don't know why she does that. I don't know. I mean, she's four. I get it. But I don't know why she don't just say, hey, I've hurt myself. Um, you know, <laughs> come to me, cry. You no, know, she always runs away. She don't want to tell you what's wrong. She just has a meltdown, and I, I have to really talking to her for a little bit to find out what's going on and i knew something was wrong with her hand because she was holding her hands and i could just tell anyway um well i thought shala was coming where did she go i'm losing everybody scarlet shala anyway so yeah a dramatic evening <laughs> the day in the life of a mom all right, see you next time. Oh, hey guys, well, I'm thinking about it. Let me turn this camera around. So we are on Instagram. Uh, uh, that's on my shirt. That's, I'm a hot mess, but this is part of my shirt. It's not a big black blob. Anyway, um, it's three chaotic kids, one, I think. So go over there and follow us if you're on Instagram. We appreciate it. It doesn't like, Instagram doesn't pay us or anything. We just would like to have you over there following us and watching us and we're also on patreon if you want to go over there and support us on patreon it's five bucks and all that money will go towards um i see scarlet she's come back out she's calm down anyway all that money on patreon will go to help us make future videos so if you want to support our channel consider looking us up on patreon appreciate it see y'all next time